Where was that coming from? What's wrong, sir? Oh, I heard this awful noise. What's going on? There's been a lockdown. A lockdown? No. Oh, God, please, not today. Well, what's so special about today? I was scheduled to undergo a, a medical procedure. It's a private matter. I'd, I'd, I'd rather not talk about it. Suit yourself. Are you okay? It sounds like you're in pain. Well, it's fine. I'm just... I got a, a condition. I, I'm waiting to have it fixed. Anything I can do? <laughs> sure, if you're an expert in corrective surgery. Sir, I'm wondering if you've seen anything suspicious lately. I haven't seen anything in over 40 years. Ah, that's your condition. I... I, I really don't feel comfortable talking about it. Fine, I won't waste your time then. Hey, wait, I did hear something. Quiet footsteps, deliberate, heavy breathing, angry, not hiding, hunting. Hmm, anything else? The smell, it seemed uh, oddly familiar, reminded me of my childhood. Your child? Yes. My family lived outside the city with all manner of creatures. When it would rain, the smell would be similar. Hmm. <laughs> Did that help me, sir? Well, I think this is going to be the start of a new video, so, um,. Part, part four now, I think. So, yeah, welcome back. I'm just sort of still trucking on. to have a word. It's about time you showed up. What the hell is going on? Why are we under lockdown? Most likely a malfunction. I'm still looking into it. Well, you ain't looking in the right places. Because I don't know nothing. Noticed anything suspicious or unusual? Other than the lockdown, I mean. Well, the couple from 104 were making an awful lot of noise a while back. More than usual, I mean. The girl ran off, and then it got quiet. Did you see where she ran off to? I ain't one to snoop. But, judging by the footsteps, I'd say she ran down to the courtyard. Anything else you can tell me about them? What? The couple? Don't know them that well. The girl seems nice enough. Not sure about the guy, though. What about the girl? Oh, she she's a trooper. Works double shifts at Chiron to support that ex-con asshole of a husband. Any idea what she might be doing for them? Can't be too important or she wouldn't be living in this shithole. Explains the look on her face, though. What do you mean by that? Worn out, fidgety, jumping in shadows. Working for the corporation has that effect, I guess. What can you tell me about the guy? Amir? I think he's called. He looks tough, but he's got the yellow eye, you know? Twitches like a junkie. Probably sells the shit, too. How do you know that? What, the dealing? I see him sneak around during the night, carrying packages and stuff. I doubt he's the goddamn postman. Does this kind of stuff happen often? You ever see a husband get violent? 
Nah, nah, he ain't a wife beater or anything like that. He's just messed up. And then again, ain't we all? Anything else out of the ordinary? Anything at all? Well, other than some asshole bringing animals into the building, I'd say that's pretty much it. Animals? Yeah, I could, uh, I could swear I heard something growling in the hallway earlier. I'd inform the janitor, but, yeah, he'd lose the plot midway through the talk anyway. Thanks. You've been very helpful. Ha! <laughs> that's new. Awesome. Yeah, no, I heard too. Nothing, I don't know why I did that. I, well, I guess we're heading down to the courtyard then. Let's get going. I'm guessing this is the right way. Above me, there, there are so many noises going on right now. So many.
Wait, can I go through here? Oh. He say he unlocked everything. Head back to 104, I guess. about this. Let's, uh... Jesus. Oh, shit. Don't be afraid. I'm here to help. Listen to me. The building's on lockdown. There's no way I can help you now. But I can get whoever's responsible for this if you help me find him. Don't try to talk. There's another way. interrogation. Go 
like that, I guess. Amir, is that you? What is going on? This game has certainly picked up, I'd say. Oh. oh, don't do it to me. 